Hi guys, welcome to, or welcome back to my YouTube channel. This week, I actually really needed to organize my dresser and it's filled with drawers, obviously. So I thought I could make it into a video because I have some really good strategies as to how to organize your drawers. So I hope you like this video and I hope you get some interesting tips on how to organize your room. Let's get on into it. First, let's get started with the clothing drawers. Does your drawer look like this? If it does, it's probably time for a change. As you can see, there's only a minimal amount of space for my jeans and leggings when I organize my drawers like this. And even if my clothes were normally folded, there still wouldn't be that much more space. So first, I'm just gonna count how many of each pair of anything we can actually fit into the drawer. To be fair, that's still quite a bit of shorts and pants and leggings, but the point is you can fit so much more if you just fold more efficiently. And I'm gonna show you how. So I use the Marie Kondo pants folding method, and basically you fold one leg over the other leg, and then you fold it in half like you would when you're normally folding pants, and then instead of folding it in half again, you fold it into three parts so that it can stand up by itself in the drawer. I also use the Marie Kondo folding method for shorts where you fold it into three parts and then you fold it in half and so it stands up by itself. Now I'm gonna see how many pants and shorts I can fit in here now. Okay, just look at the results when you fold like this. It was almost double the amount of pants that we fit in a drawer. Now I'm gonna show you how to organize a different kind of drawer. If you're not using your drawers for clothing, then you're probably going to be using them for miscellaneous items like cords, school supplies, makeup, and it may end up looking something like this where you can't ever find anything or you forget something's even there. But here's how to organize those kinds of drawers. First thing you need to do is get everything out of the drawer and onto the floor so you can see what was in the drawer and in which categories it needs to go in. Once you've emptied out your drawer, it'll probably look something like this, which is a mess. So what I like to do now is separate everything into three categories. Keep, donate, and garbage. Okay, so for this part, I had already two baskets and then I also had a little middle compartment thing that I made out of the top of a box. So I basically just used these to take the things that I had and organize them into different categories that I could later put in my drawer. Now your drawers will be organized and beautiful and quite the drastic difference than they were before. <laughs> 